seen a wildebeest, uh, zebras, other the animals running on the ground, but let's see some species flying in the air. Vultures may not be the most appealing birds to look at, but they play a crucial role in our ecosystem. They clean the environment by clearing uh, carcasses, and without them, the environment would be uninhabitable. But their numbers are dwindling fast. South African Kenry Walter is trying to change that. She works tirelessly for the conservation of the vultures, treating the wounded and sick before releasing them back to the wild. And Clementine Rogan has the story. These impressive birds help balance out our ecosystem, but they're dying at an alarming rate due to urbanization and loss of habitat. Kerry Walter and her team are trying to boost their numbers before it's too late. After hand rearing a vulture, Kerry decided to devote her life to protecting them, eventually founding Vulpro. It's the only approved vulture conservation organization in the country and is entirely dedicated to rehabilitating sick and injured vultures and releasing them back into the wild. It's the most amazing thing, you know, being able to give a bird its life back. But she couldn't save them without help from like-minded people. Vultures play a pivotal role within our ecosystem. The key role that vultures play is to clean the environment. Now, without a clean environment, basically, we cannot survive because we'll all die of diseases, we'll all die of unsanitary conditions. But by virtue that they are there and they're doing all the cleaning up, they're eating away all the animals that are dying, they're eating up everything that we really would consider dirty. So basically, they are very important. We need to conserve them because they're carrying us under their wings. Kerry and her team regularly receive wounded vultures at the sanctuary. Some are sick from human poisoning, farming chemicals, and others with broken wings caused by electric wires. You try not to get emotionally attached to the birds, but there are very specific cases that you can't help, and you do, you cry, but you do it because you want to see the birds fly free. Kerry is always researching and pioneering new ways of collecting critical data to understand how to protect vultures in the future. Tracking devices are being placed on captive birds to locate their whereabouts and rescue them when they're in danger. Another important part of the Vulpro program is educating children about the importance of conserving vultures. So you're going to see four different vulture species. I'm Lou's going to teach you all about vulture conservation, why we need to protect them, and how you guys can help protect the birds as well. This is what we call the lappet. Now, because it has got the lappet, therefore we call it a lappet-based vulture, okay? Kerry and her team work tirelessly to give vultures another chance at life. Since it began, Volpro has helped 268 birds at the sanctuary. And up in the air, Kerry is able to join the vultures on their flight to freedom. It was the most incredible experience. You join them and you're just another friend. Clementine Logan, CCTV.